alive, no thanks to you. I saw that little drubbing floozy at the marina, staring into her cellular telephone for ten minutes. Her fruitcake son, Xander, who, by the way, has a very strange relationship with his mother, told me she was taking a self... Clean out your cage when you have an upset stomach from eating hippie. I'll be honest. I figured I'd never see you again. Thought you were a little dim in the headlights. Is that how you get your jollies? Pointing a gun at an old lady? If you are expecting a handout just because you did a good deed, you have another thing coming. Oh, you're gonna let me finish? Well, I'll be honest. I figured I'd never see you again. Thought you were a little dim in the headlights, but you proved me wrong. Ah, oh, hell. Why don't you just keep the damn cat? I've enjoyed not having to deal with her incessant needs for food and water and attention the last few days. All right, off you go. We're done here. <laughs> I'm glad to see this place shut down. Hopefully for good. Peaches is one angry beast, but I think I'd rather deal with her than Mabel. I ain't much of a cat person, but she's got a taste for Peggy blood, and they ain't gonna see her coming until it's way too late. Good thing we came along when we did. I don't think these people would have lasted.
that. Head and see. Right down there! On my way. If we hit a piggy roadblock, be careful. Over you there, fuckers. Sam! I'm 
Watch out for faith. Hell of a job free in the marina. Adelaide Drubman has a bit of a pistol. She's got the means to wage a one-woman war on Eden's Gate. Just the kind of person we could use right now. See about lending her a hand. Come here, Hotcha. I need your help. Adelaide Drubman, pleased to make your acquaintance. Appreciate all your help getting my marina back, but honey, I got a problem. Those Peggy shipbirds stole my tulip. She's the nimblest goddamn helicopter this side of Montana, and I'll be goddamned if those fuck trumpets are gonna take her from me. I won that bird in my divorce fair and square. The walking erectile dysfunction who took her painted her that awful shade of Peggy Mayonnaise. So the only way you'll be able to find her is to ID the pilot. Should be easy to spot him. The only other birds around the area are flown by women. We all used to fly together on weekends, but that friendship went tits up after those thunder cunts joined Eden's Gate. So I got no problem if you accidentally shoot them in their disloyal faces. How about it, honey? You help me? And Tulip and I'll show up wherever and whenever you need us. I'll never give this beautiful bounty up. You know, I feel like if the seeds just embraced a balanced, nutritious diet, then they wouldn't be the fucked up psychos that they are, man. What you eat affects your brain compartments and departments, you know? Just look at me, I'm a normal dude. Oh, <laughs> come on, man! Shit! Sky move! Oh, this hurts! Oh, shit. Here okay. I go! What's that, Yana? I don't know. See them there? There they are. You're I just do the shit that needs to get done. Sure. Just don't forget to take care of yourself, too. What's that supposed to mean? That could have been worse. 
Decompress. I like praying for that. And that's proof God. I've got a job for any fisherman who got time. Oh, I like There's this giant fish. albino fish that swims around the marina. Locals call him Ragnar the Terrible. People have been trying to catch old Ragnar for ages, but he's damn stubborn. He likes to hang out by that little island over yonder. It'd be good for morale if someone finally caught him. I think you might have what it takes. <laughs>